Reading books is one of the best habits that I ever picked up in my life and I'm so thankful for it. In today's video we're going to explore why reading is just so good for you. Hi everybody, I'm Michael, welcome back to the Catalyst YouTube channel. So in today's video we're going to be exploring why I suggest that reading is the number one habit that you should be developing. So at the moment I'm on a bit of a challenge reading 52 books this year which is a book a week. And even if you only read a book a month, that's still 12 in a year. So the first reason that I recommend you should be reading is it gives you lots of different ideas. We often know what we think and we walk around in our own heads all day, but to actually take the time to listen to somebody else who knows a lot about the subject matter and can explore some ideas and give you some new ways of thinking is really powerful. So that's the first thing, it will develop your ideas on any topic that you want to know really. The second thing is, generally speaking, if you're reading a book that's being published, someone's taking the time to write it and to publish it, you're hoping that it's going to be of good quality. They know enough about the subject matter to have engaged in the process of getting a book published and they can physically hand you a book. If you read things on the internet, there's all sorts of good stuff, but there's also stuff that's not so good. And it's very difficult to make a quick decision on whether it's a good source, whether it's not. Whereas if you've taken the time to read a book that you've bought or borrowed from the library or got from a friend, generally you know that the information, whether you agree with it or not, is going to be of a higher quality than something that can just be put up on the internet in seconds. The third reason I suggest that you want to be reading is it can actually develop your intelligence. The way the brain works is wonderful. As long as there is emotion, strong intent and powerful imagery attached, then the brain sometimes doesn't actually know the difference between what's real and what's imaginary. So when you're reading a book and you're thinking of the images and creating situations and involving yourself as a character, maybe even feeling the emotions, to your brain, that's real. That's as vivid and as real as it can be. So that can actually be changing the way you think, changing the way your brain operates for the better. So it's not a case of you just read something, you've forgotten it. It stays in your mind. It can affect you as deep as a memory of something that happens in real life. So that's a very powerful reason. And finally, the last reason I suggest is it's also fun. There's so many things that you can read about that are just really good for pleasure. It's also quite an active way of having fun. It's not passive. If you're watching something, yes, you're taking it in and yes, you can be engaged by it. But if you're reading, you're taking an active part in it. So if someone's describing a character, your character looks different in your mind to somebody else's character. There isn't just one way of looking at it. And that can be really fun, interpreting things and seeing how different people can come up with different ways of looking at things and then talking about them. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed that video. I love reading. It's one of the best habits that I've ever formed. And from when I was a child reading the cereal box, uh, when I used to read when I was eating my breakfast, I just absolutely love it. And it will never end. And there's always so much that we can read. So please like and share and subscribe. It'd be great to have you as a subscriber. All right, take care, guys. Have a fantastic day. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to find out more, I'm here on kataholos.co.uk. So I clicked on the link below. And you can see here's our values. And you can either subscribe to our newsletter and become one of our subscribers, or you can click on the 10-week course to go to learn more. There it is. It gives you all the information you need.